Hey guys, this is Paul from Hi-Fi Man. Today, I want to show you how to change the boot logo for the BMW Linux screen. Now, I want to show you the original boot logo when you power on the car. This is the default logo, right? I want to change the boot logo. To change the logo, there are two steps. The first is to upgrade the firmware to V2037. And then, we need to prepare the logo picture name update logo. The format is PNG. Okay, now let's go. This is the new firmware V2037. After time low, you discompress it. Uh, let me show you. This the firmware we need to upgrade first. Now I copy to the USB drive. The first thing is to format the USB drive. Format FIT32 format. Okay, it have format, right? Here. Yeah. So we copy the firmware to the UTIS. Copy. Okay, we have copied, right? And is it the USB drive? Now, the first thing we upgrade the firmware first. After power on, we connect the UTIS to the USB, right? Okay, and then we go to setup. Sixteen. Firmware update. Yeah, firmware update, right? Uh, system update. But please notice, we need to use a pin to uh, to press the update button on the side. This model is 12.3 inch. That is on the side. If your model is 10.25, it is on the top, right? Okay, we press it. Hold it. And then, uh, click the system update. Hold this. Please notice, hold this. And then, we will see Vertify Pass. And then, we click it. Uh, hold the middle all, all the time. Okay, we see this and move the hand from the reset button. Uh, then it will go to update. We need to wait the uh, update with the patience. Don't cut off the power during update. This is quite important. Okay, now, so we can remove this from the USB drive. Okay, we have removed it. And then we can restart. Power off first. And then power on. After reboot the unit, we can go to setup to check the firmware. Here is the firmware. This one. Now, we continue to upgrade the Local. Now I find a picture uh, like this. This is the boot logo. I want to change to this. Okay, but please notice the picture resolution is this. This is the picture resolution, and the picture format is 
PNG. The name is Update Local. So, it's just like this. This is quite important, okay? This picture is already uh, this resolution. So I just copy it and rename this picture. Uh, you can see, uh, it should be like this. Update local PNG, uh, just like this. So we copy it, but please notice, we need to format the USB drive. Uh, format. Format. The format is FIT32 here. Okay? Here. Format. Okay? Format. It has format, right? Uh, like this. So I just copy the picture to the USB drive. Okay, uh, we easy. And then I will show you uh, how to update it. The first, we power off first. And then we connect the USB cable. And then we power on. We just wait for it. You can see, it says success. It says need to reboot the system, so we can remove this UTIS. Remove it, and then we power off, and we power on again. You can see, the screen have changed the logos. Here. But if your version is old version, uh, older than this version, it will not support to do this. It not allow. So we only upgrade to this version, and it can support to DIY the boot logo. Okay.